What's going on guys? So today I have uh, a surprise package. Wasn't expecting this. This is a Yabo and it came with some really cool looking stuff. So first I want to read the, the letter here for you. It says, uh, Dear Jeff, hope all is well. I finally got around to sending you this package. I've been meaning to get this out to you since last Christmas, but since I haven't gotten around to it, I've slowly added more items. Uh, there are just some tokens of my appreciation for you and your channel. I've been watching since I got into Zippos in like 2010, 2011, uh, and it's so dope to me uh, that you still upload great content. Now I'm starting to get into knives because of you. As a true collector at heart, I've stuck to mostly sneakers and other hype stuff. Uh, I've always found the crossover of hype brands and other tools, tool brands so cool. So I've included some recent collections of Supreme and other tool companies to get your opinion on it. I also added a deck of cards for Christina's collection. I hope I spelled it right. Yes, you have. Uh, Christina spells her name without an H. It's C-R-I-S-T-I-N-A. <laughs> it's something she always has to correct when she's, you know, like DMV, places like that. But, uh, but yeah, you spelled it right. Thank you. Uh, and it'll be cool to get her reaction slash opinion on them. I hope you enjoy these items and feel free to do with them as you please. I also got to say, R.I.P. Gus, please keep us, keep up the great content. Take care, John at Delgad. So thank you so much, John. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for the kind words. Um, I actually showed this to Christina before I turned the, the camera on. She loves the cards. So that's where we're going to start with the cards. So we have a bicycle deck here, and this is Supreme branded. These are their clear plastic cards. These are super cool. Like, really, really cool. Um, I actually have a pair of plastic cards, or a deck of uh, plastic cards, but they're not nearly as nice as these. I like how, you know, there's some clear windows uh, through the center of the card as well. The ones I have, I think, are just the uh, the rims here. But these are super, super cool. The advantage, obviously, is you can get them wet and stuff. Um, you have to be a little careful because they are plastic. You don't want them to crease. But in general, you're not folding regular playing cards either. But it, it is just super, super nice. And Christina does absolutely love it. So thank you so much for that. Really appreciate it. Um, I, I'm aware of the Supreme brand. I never really understood what it meant. I didn't know if it was like a clothing line or something. It, as he said, it's a, it's a hype brand. So you see a lot of collaborations with different companies and stuff. So he sent me some, uh, some decals. Very cool. <laughs> like this one. Supreme Spaghetti. It says Supreme uh, Perfection in 10 minutes. <laughs> I thought that was kind of cool. Totally different. This is definitely going on my uh, gun safe. And then uh, two tools, one, obviously, well, both you'll probably recognize right away. All right, so we have a Zippo and we have a Leatherman. So what do we open first, A or B? B or A, A or B? B, how about B? All right, so let's look at the uh, the Zippo here. So we have dun, 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 a Supreme Zippo, which is super, super cool. So this one was made in 2020. All right, still brand new. I'm actually going to carry and use this for a little bit. So we'll go ahead and take off our child safety sticker here. So we pop this open. I'm gonna go nice and slow, make sure we don't mess up finish or anything. So yeah, S-U-P-R-E-M-E, -E. Supreme. Super cool. I love it. I really, really love this finish. I mean, outside of the logo, the actual uh, finish is like, it's like powder coat. It seems just really thick. It actually seems really durable as well. But yeah, super, super cool. So that's gonna go into the EDC. I actually have a whole Supreme EDC here. So let's uh, leave that right there for a second and take a look at this. So we have a Supreme collab with Leatherman. And look at that, we have a Squirt PS4, which is a fantastic tool to begin with, but I really, really love the red. Of course, Supreme logo, but it's this beautiful, like burgundy red. You can see the difference um, compared to the Zippo, which has like more of a, uh, I don't know, like a bright fire truck red. Super, super cool though. This is seriously a very, very uh, useful tool. All right. I absolutely love these little uh, leather mints. Carry them all the time. So really, really nice. I mean, I can't, I can't thank you enough. This was really, really cool of you. Uh, I think it's awesome that you have these uh, different hobbies. I mean, obviously, people watch these videos who you know, like knives, you like Zippo lighters, you like you know a couple things here and there that I do. But there's so many other collections and hobbies that I get exposed to. You know, the sneaker game I've talked to briefly. I'm not really into sneakers. I like nice sneakers. 
I just don't have the money or the time to focus on another hobby, you know, but there is a satisfaction of having something nice that you're actually wearing out, you know, people who appreciate, you know, nice quality clothing, you know, it's an investment in your life. We all need clothes. We don't need knives, dare I say it. No, we do. We do need knives <laughs> for sure. But you know what I'm saying, right? So it, it's kind of cool, the whole sneaker game thing, but I can, I couldn't possibly keep up, you know, it's just, uh, it's insane and how much money and um, you know how uh, sought after some of these shoes are that are just super rare and super hard to get. And you know, it's kind of like with knives though, maybe you got that new pair of Jordans or something, uh, or Yeezys and uh, you just, you know, you spent $800 on it or something and do you wear them? You know, it's like the guy who, or the girl who spends $500 on a knife, you know, do you carry it? You know, it's kind of strange because I can't help but think that some of the people out there who are into like the shoe game, for example, you know, you spend seven, eight hundred dollars on a pair of shoes, you might not want to wear them. You know, it's like, it's a cool collectible. Maybe you wear them, you know, shopping at the mall for an hour or something, but like, you know, you don't just like play basketball in them or something or just walk down the street randomly. Uh, just like some of the people out there who I know have four and five hundred dollar knives and they just, you know, maybe gets a little bit of pocket time, but not much. You know, sometimes it's hard because when you spend a lot of money like that, especially if you don't have that money normally to spend, um, it becomes an investment and you don't want them to get messed up. You don't want them to get scratched or dirty and you want to retain that value. Of course, they're all things that are meant to be enjoyed and used, but as the, uh, the owner, it's up to you how you enjoy them. Whether it's a knife that never gets used, but you admire and look at and flick open and, you know, or the pair of shoes that you love and it's sitting in your closet and it looks nice and maybe you wear them once or twice, you know, at a special occasion or something, you know, teach their own. But this is awesome stuff. I will actually carry and use some of this stuff. Um, and again, thank you so much. Christina did say thank you. She didn't want to be on camera today. Uh, in fact, right now she's out of the house. Um, but she did take a look at it real quick before she left and she really wanted me to say thank you uh, to you. It was a really, really nice gesture and uh, she loves them. And maybe we'll play a little game of cards later. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you have an awesome day. Let me know down in the comment section, are you into hype brands like uh, Supreme? And let me know a little bit more about it. I'd like to get the, the Supreme branding explained maybe a little better to me because I, I've seen it everywhere. I'm aware of it. I just don't understand if they make something or it's literally a logo. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you have an awesome day. Let me know down in the comment section what other hobbies you have besides the main stuff that you see on this channel. You know, knives and guns and zippos and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'd love to hear all the, all the other uh, collections as well as hobbies. So that's all. Hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.